What is going on guys, Sonic and the Bean Show here and today we're going to be looking at the 6th wave of the 2.5 inch figures. Now obviously you guys did see that I picked these up at Target in the recent video, however these figures are unboxed and I'll show you that right now actually. So it's mainly because the Classic Tails and the Crab Meat are the only new figures in this wave. Uh, I'll explain why I bought the, um, the other Motobug. But the Sonic figure is obviously this one. This is the uh, Wave 2 Sonic figure right here. And then the Metal Sonic is, well, it's really just this. And, you know, I didn't, again, I didn't really need to, uh, you know, get those figures. That's why they're unboxed. But, uh, you know, I'm going to put them on here because, you know, they are technically part of this wave now really but um yeah so um since I have classic tails right here I'm gonna unbox this guy really all right guys so this is classic tails out of the packaging and check him out what a cute little classic tails figure right here all right so obviously let's go over the articulation for this guy so obviously the head can turn the arms can move up and down they can also move up like this Sadly, there is no swivel in the wrist. His legs can kick up about here and back about there. There's no knee joints and there's no swivel at the ankle. However, you can turn the whole leg. But of course, you can turn his tails. So there's that. Uh, just be careful because it can pop off pretty easily. Uh, I, that happened twice when I opened the package and messed around with him. But uh, you can just put it back in place. It, you know, it goes back in place really easily. So uh, yeah, just uh, keep that in mind with this classic tails figure. Alright guys, and the next figure we'll be looking at is the crab meat of course, so this is the other new figure in this wave really. Um, yeah, pretty pretty nice little crab meat. I'm really concerned how the articulation is going to be on this guy. But um, yeah, there's that and then of course this is the back right here. Now the weird thing about this crab meat is that his bio is the same as the classic tails. See, it literally just says tails is an energetic fox and you know, but... You know this is crab meat so why does it say that I, I don't know it's very very weird as a matter of fact see this is crab meat right here and then if i put it aside with the tails it's about the same see tails is energetic fox tails is energetic fox. i don't know but uh yeah it's a little error right there but uh, i just wanted to point that out right there all right guys so here is crab meat this is how he looks he's very very small honestly uh yeah really little really little funny crab meat figure but uh, let's go with the articulation though. So his arms can move up and down like this. They can also turn as so. They can't turn. Well, this one, it, uh, well, actually, yeah, you can't actually turn all the way. You can also move his legs like that. See, <laughs> you can move it like that uh, just a little bit. But uh, yeah, that's really just that. And you also can uh, turn him a little bit too. So that's uh, pretty neat right there. Has like a little swivel going on. So uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty cool right there. But um yeah that's um that's about it for crab meat. There's nothing else that you can really uh move. I think it's just his uh you know his claws and then his uh his feet right here. Um one thing about crab meat is I can't really get this guy to stand no matter how many times I try to mess around with Oh well eh, yeah, I guess I got it there. Um yeah. So I guess you can't make him stand. You just got to you know spread uh the legs a little bit, but uh yeah, that's crab meat. A uh, really nice little crab meat figure there. Um pretty unique that they did crab me um this is really awesome so there you have it guys all right and finally we're going to do the moto bug all right so now i gotta be careful to open in this guy all right so obviously i'm not gonna review this guy since i already did however let me tell you guys a little story right here so um i did obviously i did you know the review of this guy in wave three and one in uh, my video but here's the thing when i opened him i literally just took him out and i threw the package in a way but I didn't even know he came with the stand. So that's why that's why I had to buy another one. I, I looked at a review and I was like, he came with a stand? And I threw that away. And I was actually close to doing that with the Buzz Bomber too. So yeah, so I just never had the stand for this guy. Uh, I didn't even know he came with the stand, like I said. But, um, you know, I got one now, of course. So yeah, um, well, now I own two of these, really. But uh, yeah, uh, I finally got the stand for that. So that's the only reason why I had to get uh, another motor bug. All right, so here's Crab Me along with the Moto Bug and the Buzz Bomber, and they look pretty cool together, honestly. Um, it's cool that we're getting some Bad Nick figures. Here's a side by side comparison with my Classic Tales and the Modern Tales by Jax. Here's a comparison with the Wave Three Modern Tales right here with the you know the different tails right there. So, and uh, it's that. Here's a comparison with the Tomy Classic Tales. Um, really, really awesome figures, honestly. Um, I, I do actually like this one more though. But the Tomy Classic Tales it still isn't that bad. But obviously, uh, this one is still pretty good because you know this one you you know you can still move the tails. This one you couldn't, sadly, as you can see. Me trying to move it. 
And finally, here's a comparison with the Classic Sonic. Uh, yeah, they actually look really good together. It's pretty, pretty cool. <laughs> I really do wish that uh, Classic Sonic was in a regular pose like how Classic Tails is, you know? And then if you guys are concerned, this is how he looks with the Classic Sonic with the uh, Chili Dog. Uh, all we need now is just a classic um, Knuckles, and that would be pretty dope. And then maybe if we can get Ray too, because then we can get, like, you know, the Sonic Mania Plus, um, you know, cast. But, um, yeah. I mean, again, these are really, really great figures, though. Um, they did amazing with this classic Tails, though. I'll say that. All right, guys. That's going to be it for this unboxing here. So, thank you so much for watching. And I will definitely catch you guys in the next video. Take care, my friends.